Yo, what's up guys? Today we're having vegan sushi. We have the shrimpless hand roll and the vegan seared salmon nigiri. Vegan crunchy California roll. It's nice and plated. I know it's not sushi etiquette, but I just always have to do this. I'm so excited and hungry. I fasted until 6 o'clock. This is my first meal during this recording. I am starving. Can't forget the ginger. So I'm eating vegetarian for the month of February, partially for Lunar New Year because it started in February this month. It's kind of like a general New Year's resolution for anyone who celebrates it. It's always great to start the year eating vegetarian. It doesn't involve killing an animal. It's, you know, it's good karma. Um, it is just a great way to kind of like start the year fresh. I also have an ayahuasca retreat at the end of this month. If you guys don't know what ayahuasca is, just Google it real quick. Um, it's kind of like a spiritual healing journey thing. It's like three days um involving <laughs> involving psychedelic plants and stuff like that i'm all open to that and also my buddy who kind of connected me to that he told me to eat vegetarian for the month just so i can cleanse my body and have a better experience once i go and do this whole thing so yeah i'm excited and nervous at the same time but it's a fun experience to just try to eat vegetarian and um, I've been doing it a week now. It just took me a week to finally do a video with this vegan sushi and this place is amazing. I found them years ago but they closed and I guess they reopened again after COVID. I think that's enough intro and explanation. Let's get into it because I am starving. First off, um, let's try one of these. Into my wasabi soy sauce. I'm so excited guys. First hit, cheers. Mm. That's just so good. I'm sure it'd be crispier if I ate it more fresh. It took me a while to like set up and actually get to eating. But oh my god. This thing is amazing. <laughs> it tastes so good. Mm. I feel like vegan sushi should actually be kind of easy to make because everything is so, everything but the fish is vegetarian. So you're able to kind of like find good substitutes for the protein. Man, money. So good. I always have ginger in between my sushi meals because ginger is healthy and also helps cleanse your palate. So when you take a, a bite of the next piece of sushi that isn't what you just ate, the flavor of what you ate before doesn't affect the next piece of sushi. So... Ginger is great for that as well. Cheers. You would never catch me eating raw ginger anywhere else. With just the way it works with sushi, this makes it a lot easier. I'm doing one more of these. I'm doing one more and then I'll move on to um, the salmon. This thing is so good. Mm. I don't know it's because I'm super hungry or this food is just super amazing probably both most likely both mm. I think there's a sauce on this seared salmon nigiri already but like, it just looks, oh my god, I dropped the, the onions. The crispy onions on top look so good. It's 
Look at that. It's beautiful. Oh, I just put it on my hand. Yeah. Just look at that. Just look at that. It just looks beautiful. I don't know what protein they use to imitate the salmon, but I know they pre probably use like seaweed for like the fried side, but uh, the fried outside. But this just looks amazing. I don't want to ruin it with the chopsticks, so I'll eat it by itself, and then I'll do soy sauce after. But like, there's already like a sauce on it. Cheers. Mm. Oh my god. Mm. So good. And it's pretty affordable. Price isn't crazy. About five fifty for the hand roll, five fifty for nigiri. That's like regular sushi price. And the roll is like 10 to like 15 bucks. I think the, my overall total was about 25 bucks. Around there. A little over I think. But so good for vegan. So if you're vegan or vegetarian or just eating it for whatever reason, definitely stop by Kensho in Westminster. I'll list the uh, details and address and everything in the description. Stop by, give them a um, give them a try. And, you know, show some love and support. They need it, and it's amazing. <clears throat> I mean, all all restaurants need more support and and help. You know, so and they deserve it because they are so good. The staff is super friendly. It's a decent location. It's right next to a freeway. One more of this, and then I'll start with the shrimpless hand roll. I tried this one already, and it is amazing. Mm. I lied. I mean, you know what? No, let's just use whatever imitation protein they can find or whatever one they use is amazing it feels like imitation crab meat you know the avocado the cucumber the little sauce on top and the onions is just a nice touch mm. I literally forget that I'm eating a vegetarian or a vegan meal. And it's amazing. Oh, um, let's do a little more ginger. So I don't want to... So, oh, usually ginger is great when you follow it after like a very savory or like sweet piece of sushi. And then when you want to go into something else, it's great to kind of like cleanse that. But when you eat like a fresh piece of sushi and you go into something like sweet and savory, you don't really need it that much. So of course they use a vegan piece of shrimp. It's not imitation shrimp either, but they use like fish protein. It's an actual like just vegan vegetarian, I'm pretty sure like a gelatin base too. But it looks good. Oh man, I can't wait. <laughs> I cannot wait. Let's put a little soy sauce on this baby. This looks so good, guys. Cheers. Mm. Why is it so good? Mm. <laughs> mm. So happy. And honestly, after eating over like a week of vegetarian food, I feel great. 
I feel great. I'm always hungry because it doesn't stay in my stomach long. Some more ginger. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, and after and at the end of every sushi meal, I usually do like a wasabi hit, which is pretty much just one piece of sushi, and I put as much wasabi as I can. Usually like a whole packet, and then just go on, go on along for the ride. You know, after that, that's all you can really do. But yeah. <laughs> I, I, I can't do extremes like eating a lot or like super spicy food, but I don't know why. This is wasabi is something I can handle. So that's my extreme for my type of channel or the way I eat. I feel like everyone got to have an extreme of something. And wasabi is just what I'm most comfortable with. So good. Okay, um, I'm down to like kind of final the final pieces. Let's do um, the salmon nigiri. Salmon nigiri, one piece of this. Finish that last piece, and then wasabi hit. I cal I I calculate my bites. I really do. <sighs> Up until the last one, excuse me. <clears throat> excuse me. <clears throat> excuse me. Try to get all the crispy onions on this thing. I'm not gonna dip it because I don't want all the onions to fall off, so I'm just gonna drizzle a little bit of the soy sauce on it and call it. Look at that masterpiece. Mm, there we go. It's dripping on the table, it's okay. Cheers, guys. Mm. It tastes so good. It tastes like seared salmon. I don't know how. And the fact that it's vegan, the protein just breaks down and just melts in your mouth. So it's like, it imitates like the freshest sushi. Because the fresh sushi just melts in your mouth because the, the meat is so fresh and just breaks apart. Vegan sushi is just like that. Because whatever substitute protein they use is usually on the softer side. So when you eat, oh my god. Amazing. I'm so glad I went vegetarian and found this place again. Oh my god. I, I feel like even after I'm done being vegetarian, I'll still come back here. For sure. Mm. Hand roll. Almost done with the soy sauce too. Boy, this is delectable. Delectable. Mm. Nice chunk of shrimpless shrimp right there. 
I'm just gonna kill this. So good. I guess. <laughs> I'm just used to eating with my hands. Which is sushi etiquette for sushi. So I'm not being a kid or a slob. <laughs> oh, this is my just finish all this up too. This has been an amazing meal. I thank you guys so much for staying with me and watching and with the comments and watching my lives and whoever watches me watches me cross platform. I appreciate you guys. I appreciate you guys so much. Y'all amazing. I really can't thank you guys enough. So just I appreciate you guys. Thank you. Cheers. I didn't think I was going to get full, but I'm getting full. Whew. All right, now for the wasabi hit. One piece, one whole packet of wasabi. The whole packet. Every last bit. Let's do this. Hi right, guys, last hit and wasabi hit. Cheers. Packet ones are the worst because it's all horseradish. Oh. Oh. Alright, guys, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate y'all. I'll catch you guys next time.